Hey guys, it's Joe here and welcome back to another iPod talk slash pillow talk. So, I was just outside with my family, um, my mother, my grandmother and my mum's best friend. And we were chatting, right, having a conversation as we normally do. And this situation happened, right? Let me sit down. Alright? So, we were just sitting and chatting like this. And the topic of tattoos came up, right? And they were all saying they're in like their fifties and up. Um, like let's say forties and up. They were saying how like it's a bad thing, it's discriminant like they were discriminating people. They were saying how like having tattoos is wrong and horrible and all of this stuff and I'm here like but tattoos are fine. You know, they're saying how like it's fine if men have tattoos, but for women it's not. You're telling me, if I get a tattoo, you're going to hate me, but if I was a male, you'd think it would be fine? How does that physically sound to you? Let that sing in your head for a second. That sucks, you know? Just because I'm a female doesn't mean I can't do the things that a male does, you know? I might not be able to do it as well, but it doesn't mean I can't do it. So, yeah. Anyway... Another thing as well is that I get really frustrated when people keep saying that, oh, it's fine on men. Men can have all of this because it's fine on them. It looks perfectly fine. But for women, it's like, what was she thinking? She was thinking what she wanted to think. A tattoo is something that is permanent and it is something that is special in meaning to you. If you want to get one but are terrified, A, this community is not going to disrespect you or nothing if you have tattoos everywhere, if you have piercings everywhere, if you're a different culture, different race, if different sexual, if you cannot figure out what sex you like, if you cannot figure out what gender you are, it does not matter, alright? Because in this family, we look after each other. And all I wanted to say is, is that if you're thinking about getting a tattoo, please talk to your family about it. Even if it's your partner that you're currently with, if it's your kids, if it's your parents, like your mum and dad, or if it's just your mums, or if it's your dads, or if it's your best friend, talk to someone about it. Say, like, look, I'm thinking about getting a tattoo. What is your guys' opinions? If they full-on go off at you saying, look, I hate it, blah, 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 make an agreement with them. Be like, right, I really want a tattoo. Maybe I can get it in a place where I can hide it. So, for example, like, your stomach, or your ribs, or your back or even like your wrist because more than likely that's not a place on mind just remember talk to them about it because there's no point in you getting a tattoo and be like well I'm being a rebel when you got like some stupid tattoo of a circle like get something that means something to you if it's like your favorite let's say you're getting this cartoon character drawn on you right tattooed on you and it's because that was the first movie that you and your husband saw or the first movie that you shared with your kids or whatever or it's the first thing you ever saw that's fine you need to make sure that you physically can rock it and that you physically are comfortable with having that on your skin for the rest of your life so I just get frustrated when people are like oh but if a woman in her 70s had a tattoo on, I think that's disgusting. But if a man in his 70s had a tattoo, I'd be like, oh, he was in the military. Excuse me? Why couldn't you think, oh, maybe she was in the military and had a tattoo? Or maybe, you know, it has meaning to her. Why is it just because we have something doesn't mean it can't have meaning, you know? Tattoos, yes, they're a huge deal, but it's a meaningful thing, you know? I have family members who have tattoos. I'm not going to hate them because of it. You know, I have family members who have tattoos and I still don't know what the hell half of them mean. And then there are some tattoos where I get the meaning of it. It might be their child's handprint or it could be, you know, just a symbol of an anchor showing that they are keeping themselves afloat or anchoring their family, you know, they have like a family motto or something, you know. But I wouldn't think, oh, you know, she's so horrible, but he looks pretty cool, even though they have the same tattoo. I just don't get that. So, 
I don't understand the whole thing. Like, I guess I grew up in a world where tattoos are fine and they're normal and it's a thing. You know, all celebrities are getting tattoos, all YouTubers are getting tattoos, and family are getting tattoos, and friends, and all this stuff, and I grew up with that. And I guess they didn't, because back in their time period, tattoos were a very expensive thing. It was very much like, why are you getting a tattoo? Like, it's very much like, I'm being a rebel, woohoo! Like, do you know what I mean? So I guess it was difficult for them to understand, but we're in a new time period now where that is okay, you know? They need to learn that that is okay, and it's not going to destroy people's lives. You know, it's just how it is. I just, sometimes I don't get it, and sometimes I get confused, but, you know, we learn to love and we learn to grow. And it might be a bit of a struggle, but, you know... I wouldn't get mad if my friend had got a tattoo and, you know, I'd be mad they didn't tell me first, but I wouldn't be like, oh, I'm not going to be your friend now because you have a tattoo. Like, no, you know, respect your friends. If they, you know, got one and it's like, look, I got a tattoo and it's a biblical reason to them or it's a religious meaning to them or a family reason or anything, I wouldn't be like, you got a tattoo, we can't be friends now and leave. Hell no. Respect them, man. If I was like that, I wouldn't be watching Jack. I wouldn't be watching Marty's vlogs. I wouldn't be watching PewDiePie. I wouldn't be watching half the people I watch, you know. I wouldn't be talking to family members. I wouldn't be talking to some of my friends. I wouldn't be doing a lot of things. But I'm not letting fear stop me. Just because they have a tattoo doesn't mean they're a rebel. It doesn't mean, oh, she's a badass. Like, no. It just means they got something that means something to them. Like, yeah, some people might say, look, I got this from a video game. To you, it's like, why the hell would you do that? You're going to hate that in 50 years and, like, write all these comments. But to them, it could be the first video game they play with their brother. It could be the first video game that they got when it changed their life. You know, it could be something meaning to th meaningful to them, and they just don't want to tell you. It's as simple as that. You know... People have to think about these things. They just don't go into a store and be like, draw a lollipop on me, because I like lollipops. No. You know what I mean? People think of these reasons, and people think, right, I'm getting this imprinted into my body. What am I going to have? You know? Anyway, I just made this whole vlog just to tell you guys that, you know, I don't care what you get. I don't care if you get a tattoo. I don't care if you guys think... Tattoos are horrible or if they're great. I don't care if you guys think the piercings are horrible or great. I personally believe that if you get a tattoo for a particular reason, that's perfectly fine. I just don't... I personally would not get a full arm sleeve tattoo. But if you have one, awesome, man. Like, mad, mad props to you for going through that pain. You know, I think tattoos are great. They're meaningful. I would not get my whole face pierced, but if you do, that's cool too. Good job with the pain, and how do you keep that so clean? You know, that'd be my question. But it's just always a challenge for me, because, you know, I can't, con like, I can't do things, like, obviously I can't now, because I'm only 16, but seeing family members get them, and I'm like, is it really that bad? Like, what's the point? I see, you know, dance teachers who teach me to dance how tattoos and I'm like you know if my mum found out they did would she still send me to the school like that wouldn't be the breaking point if a teacher had a tattoo at your school would you be like well obviously I'm not learning from her because she's too much of a badass and well she's gonna be rock hard on me I'm like rock hard that's not all what I meant take it back with your weird people take it back I meant as in strict anyway my point is is that just because Someone has a tattoo does not mean you should judge them. You know, if I worked for a company and I was trying to hire people, right, I wouldn't go, oh, you have a tattoo, get out of my store. You know, I'd be like, all right, let's look at your resume, let's look at that, let me have you on a trial run, see what your personality is like, stuff like that. I wouldn't go, they have a tattoo and a piercing, get out of my store. You know, who cares? Try and have more of an open mind, all right, guys? Even if it's... You're very strict. You're like, I hate tattoos. Just be like, okay, if my friend got a tattoo, I'd be okay with that. If, 
I see someone with a tattoo, I'm not going to think they're a bad person. Just see what happens and see how it goes. That's all I'm asking, just trying to have an open mind. Anyway guys, thank you guys so much for watching this vlog slash pillow talk slash iPod video. If you liked it, let me know in the comments below. Also, do you guys have a tattoo or have been thinking about getting a tattoo? What would it look like? Let me know. Anyway, dry out. See you guys in the next video. Sorry, guys. I'm out. Let's bring for a very casual hug. Bye-bye. We got the pin talk. I think I'm, this is just going to be called iPod vlog iPod videos. I don't know. I'd love for someone to make me like an introduction or outro screens because they look awesome on people's like videos but I do not have the skills or don't know how to do that. So if any if any of you guys know please tell me people and let me know in the comments below. Maybe I can ask them. I don't know. Anyway guys peace and also please don't discriminate. Love everyone like yeah, your brothers and sisters because they are. Peace.